Hello, welcome back to Jessup Sellers. Uh, today we're going to talk about our 2008 Napa Valley Pinot Noir. Um, this is only the second release we've ever had of Pinot Noir from one of our state vineyards in South Napa, uh, the same area our Chardonnay comes from. Um, this is a pretty exciting wine for us. You know, we've always focused more on the Bordeaux varietals with the addition of Zinfandel. Uh, and Pinot Noir is a new addition to our lineup. Um, so uh, we're pretty excited for it. You know, um, when we first released this wine, and we're shooting this today on September 15, 2011, uh, about two months ago, this wine had more of a Burgundian nose with a California palate. In the nose, you got earth and, and forest floor and all these really intense aromatics. On the palate, it was more fruit driven, like you'd expect from a California Pinot. In the last couple months, as the wine has aged, those really intense forest floor, kind of earthy aromatics have softened into this lovely coffee tone. And now you get this coffee, toffee, wild strawberry aroma to it that is it's just really spectacular. Uh, God, on the palate, mm. you know, oh, really, some of that strawberry carries through. Really, really nice notes. Wild strawberry, earth, and pepper. Um, it's got a really lovely... You know sensitivity to it. When you taste this wine, it, it's it's not light, it's not heavy. It's just got great balance, and, uh, and and as a result, it's really really good with food. Again, nice acidity to the back end, not aggressive, but just enough to give it balance and and pair really really nicely with a range of foods. And that's what I love about Pinot Noir is it has so much versatility with cuisine. Um, this is a wine, uh, you know, anytime you have an earthy wine like this, I love it with mushroom-based dishes. So that, that wild strawberry and, and, and kind of you know, earth tone goes really, really nicely with mushroom risotto or mushroom lasagna or things like that. Um, but it's also got a range of, you know, the traditional accepted wisdom of white wine with chicken and fish and red wine with red meat. You know, there's so many exceptions to that rule. And Pinot is a nice, you know, do I go white, do I go red kind of wine. So when you have, you know, Chilean sea bass with a heavy top or swordfish or ahi or salmon on the grill or heavy pasta dishes, then Pinot is a nice wine where you're not sure if you should go white or red, Pinot is a good in-room kind of a wine. Um, God, I just love this. Strawberry, earth, tobacco, a touch of pepper, but not aggressive in any tone. It's really, really nice across the board. Um, this is a wine you could serve to just about anybody and have pretty good results. We get, you know, people who are big Pinot fans and not big Pinot fans, and almost universally this seems to be a crowd pleaser for us. So we can't wait to see you and join us for a glass, a bottle, or a case. We'll look forward to seeing you soon. Thanks.